So this is where that information gets taken by people that don't understand how the IARC classifications work and it gets misconstrued into thinking that eating processed meat is the same as smoking cigarettes. I really hope a medical doctor didn't say this because this is not true. All right, so IARC classifies hazards, not risks. So even if two things are in the same IARC classification, that does not mean that they present the same risk to humans. Right, so group one means that there is compelling evidence that at least some exposure to that substance increases at least one type of cancer in humans. So again, that doesn't mean that all group one carcinogens present the same risks. All right, so if you remember from that last video, the absolute risk increase from colorectal cancer and 50 grams of processed meat daily consumption is a 1% absolute risk increase. So from 5% to 6%. Now for regularly smoking cigarettes, um, studies have shown the lifetime lung cancer risk increase from around 1% to around 17%. And the CDC estimates that smokers are 15 to 30 times more likely to develop lung cancer. So these risks aren't even of the same magnitude. So to be comparing them um, just shows a lack of understanding of what those IARC categories even mean. Keep in mind too that it's only cancer risk and not other health risks that can come along with things like smoking cigarettes. So yes, it's important to understand health risks, but it's also equally important to be communicating them correctly and putting them into perspective.